Salutations from me and my nice jacket. I come from Malaysia where we do not understand the Tina Pina joke. But I'm so happy to see all of you again, especially after the global lockdown. I'm glad that things are getting back to normal. In fact, it's getting better than normal in Malaysia because Michelle Yeoh just won Best Actress at the Oscars. First Malaysian to ever win that prestigious award, I was over the moon because for the last 10 years, I've been carrying Malaysia on my back. <laughs> on my own. <sighs> for years, I've been pleading with her, would it hurt you to help out a little, Michelle? <laughs> Just win an Oscar, it's not that hard. You've been acting for 20 years. Just act good. <laughs> But seriously, we are all very proud of her. Although some are saying, you know, she should have won it with a Chinese film, not a Hollywood one. Uh, slow down. Uh, step by step, you know. Because Chinese films and dramas are a different breed. They usually focus on misery and hardship. And it is very, it's very bad. The most famous Chinese drama is called Square Pegs. It lasted for about a thousand seasons. <laughs> It was about this guy called Ah Wong, and he was very poor, piss poor. He lives in a shit shack <laughs> with his wife and his grandmother who's on a wheelchair, can't walk. And you may think, oh man, this is so sad. But Chinese say, no, not sad enough. <laughs> because Ah Wong, Ah Wong is a weird person. He's so easily excitable, but also very clumsy. So bad things keep happening to him over and over again. There was this episode called Ah Wong's Birthday. He's sitting in the dark, and then the wife shows up with a birthday cake. She somehow scrounged enough to make one for him. And he's so excited, and he looks, and he's overwhelmed. You made a cake for my birthday. We have no money. You made a cake for my birthday. And he starts tearing. And you may think, man, this is sad. But Chinese say, no, not sad enough. <laughs> Let's try something. Every time I say, but Chinese say no, you join me with not sad enough. Are we okay? Is that agreeable? Okay, so they can say I did some crowd work. Okay. <laughs> so, before the cake arrives, Ah Wong does a little dance because he's so excited and accidentally hits the cake from the wife's hand. The cake spins in the air, it somersaults in slow motion, falls to the ground in pieces. There's cake everywhere. There's candles everywhere. It's ruined. And Ah Wong is like, my, 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 my the cake. Right? And the wife and grandma is, oh, the, oh, the, the cake. And you may think, man, this is really sad. But Chinese say, no, not sad enough. The wife goes, forget about the cake, Ah Wong. He said, Ah Wong, forget. You made this for my birthday. I will eat it. And he falls to the floor and eats cake from the floor while crying. And you may think this is super sad, but Chinese say no, not sad enough. The wife is, Ah Wong, Ah Wong, forget about the stupid cake. Ah Wong, please forget. Okay, Ah Wong, you are my husband. If you can eat cake from the floor, I will eat it with you. She falls to the floor, starts shoving cake in her mouth. Grandma joins. Grandma also is coming. They fall on the floor. Three miserable people are eating cake on the floor, shoving into their mouths while crying and hugging each other. And you may think, Douglas, please stop. This is too sad. But Chinese say no, not sad. Remember the candle? Ignites the curtain, whole house burned down. Thank you so much for playing along. Hope you have a wonderful festival. Terima kasih.